I'm Dorothy Marsick and this is Dick Daft. We're the authors of Building Management Skills and we're sitting here with Don Downey who is the filmmaker who did the awesome videos, Caffeine and Crawlers, that come with the textbook. And while we were doing the videotaping, I was so impressed with Don's ability to be a manager in a very complicated and chaotic system that we wanted to ask him some questions about the skills that you need to be a filmmaker in that kind of situation. Lots of it is, is the type of planning we do, first and foremost. Filmmaking is so much about trying to cover a lot of material and get everything right in a very specific amount of time, which means that we need a really excellent plan to do it. The planning process starts from the script, and the first pass is really just to get a like a 50,000 foot view of the story that we're trying to tell, what elements we're going to need. You know, in this case, we knew we needed to find an office where we could move through the office in a, in a very organic way and, and not have it be like you know, a bunch of really flat sets. But also all the other technical elements, the, the casting elements, just to, which really start from trying to get the big picture so that we know what it is that our goals are gonna be for this production. From there, we always go to the budget. In filmmaking, the budget is everything. Coming up with a good budget document is how you come up with a plan of what people you need, what materials and locations you need, and, and what time you need to achieve this project. There's something about pinning resources to personnel and all of the elements that you need to successfully pull off this project that really clarifies here's exactly like who we need, what we need, how much we have to spend, and how do we do it. Then I really spend some time as a director with the script and really get a great sense of what's gonna happen in each scene, in each moment to moment inside each scene. If I'm incredibly well prepared for them, I have so much more ability once I get on set to be free, to be improvisational, to let things happen and let the actors do their thing and let the camera guys do their thing. But if you haven't done that preparation work, it gets really complicated really fast.